Alright, so we're playing GTA 5 today, and before we get into the video, I want to show you guys the games that we possibly could be playing besides GTA and Fortnite, so roll it. So as the list on the screen is shown, the games that you are seeing are the games that we are capable of playing, which consist of Batman Arkham series, the Battlefield Hardline, and Dead by Daylight, which both games expire on July 30th, because I have the Xbox Game Pass. We have Granny Chapter 2, which we never finished, we have Rainbow Six Siege, we have Marvel's Avengers, we have Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, we have Warzone. Now, to branch off from that content, we can go into PS5 content, because I now have the PS5. We can do Miles Morales, we can do Spider-Man PS4 Remastered, and we can do Mafia 3. I can't get more games on the PS5, but right now they're just remastering PS4 games, or not even remastering them. They're just letting you just play PS4 games, there's not really that many of them out. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to let y'all get back to the GTA, and uh, yeah, go ahead, see y'all. Alright, so now that you guys seen the games we can play... Uh, I'm gonna let y'all get back to Grand Theft Auto 5. Leave some comments down on what games you would like to see played, and uh, yeah. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. Oh, God. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy. You oh, can no. say that, Steve. I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've exactly. handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career. Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Steve, oh, come whoa! On, please. You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh well, then let me rephrase. Wow. Why? Why? Because, because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business. Exactly. Deals, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect. Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael to Thanks. try and explain things. I want to do him. more talking. Steve can catch these hands. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. Put your gun down. Exactly. Where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And now you want me to clean up your mess again. Exactly. Right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Exactly. Fucking good luck with that. <laughs> the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American Put your weapons down, all of you. <laughs> Who the fuck are you with? <laughs> hey. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Fuck Dog. you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Oh Yo, that's some good Kool-Aid. Bro, they really put they really put me in this situation right now. But, Sit down. Don't even try it. I ain't going in. See where Davy is. There's some more of these guys kill each other. All right. Yes, sir. Snake pop. Snake pop. Who next? Who next? Who next? Come on, come on. Oh. What happened to Haynes? He get caught in the crossfire? Am I wrong? Burn. Or did the Shadow War just step into the light? What? Okay. No, give me the heavy one. Oh, shut up. Oh, that's that's that shot. Give me that. Oh shoot! I think I do. I guess. And why not? Hey, bro, watch your jet. Watch your jet, bro. Watch your jet! I just gave him a crispy new haircut. The fuck? Hey! He called that one in the chamber. You, old friend. It's gonna be me! <clears throat> oh! You here to finish the job, T? No, 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 no. I'm just 
volunteer for the opportunity. Now run! What are you doing smoking, huh? Come on. No, no, no. Alright, so basically what's going on here is that Trevor gets on Michael about not telling him that their friend Brad has passed since their last um, robbery. And now Trevor's like, okay, I may want to kill you right now, but we can at least get this one last heist that we've been planning on doing for the longest time. Get it over with and separate and blah, blah, blah. So they're going to phone in Lester. Lester's going to be like, okay, and then they're all going to, you know, get ready for the heist. So now that that's done, let's go. Hey. Pause! What is that? What you doing here? I mean, I'm real glad you're here. Come here. Come I can't on. stay. What's up, babe? Look, it's Lamar. What that fool want now? It's your best friend. He's your best fucking friend. For cool. real. My best friend. My homeboy, right? My nigga. Man, fuck you. I mean, not like that, man. But no, he ain't. He just another nigga from the hood. Him, stretching all the motherfucking clowns. All he want to do is drag a motherfucker down and live in the past. And this is the future? A big empty house with nobody who gives a fuck about you. Well, shit, it works for me. It can work for you, babe. I'm getting married, Franklin, to a doctor, not a murderer. Then what the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm worried about Lamar. You got to help him, Franklin. What? Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. You a phony fuck. What? I ain't saying you gotta marry the fool. I'm saying he's about to get killed over that deal you and him put on with Stretcher set him up. Oh, fuck, man. My whole fucking life I've been looking after this motherfucker and paying a price afterwards. Fuck. Well, at least do it one more time, Franklin, for me. For you? So, Bug Eye Bandit gonna walk in my crib, then has the nerve to flaunt the fact that she's getting married to a doctor, put my friend into the situation. And then try and use that as a way. Oh, do that for me. Man, shut your lame ass up. Man, shut up. Oh, shoot. Hey, hey, hey. Why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, we'll try to shut the fuck up. Now, let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. This is crawling with ballers, you know? Now, me and you, we don't mind the old gang warfare, but suede bucks over there. <laughs> Tell Trevor I said, bite me. Man, I said, shut up. Now, I see the weed, but where the fuck is Lamar? Oh, shit, there he go. You know what? Tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic, classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna find a way in. I saw a few possible entry points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. I'm meeting them head on. Direct assault. Hey, I'm gonna get in position. Hey, I got a good vantage. I'll see what I can do up here when the time comes. I reckon our best shot is coming at them from two different directions. Mate. Give us the signal when you're ready, Frank. Let's go find the dude. Right, let's go. Here I come, assholes! Lamar! Lamar! Easy. Y'all are free. Come on, come on, come on. Peek, 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 boy. Hop. Shmeet. Get on. We'll go 
Weave. Give me that. Oh. You know what? Boy! Frank, Frank. I got eyes on Lamar! Hey, Lamar! Let's go before let's go. they turn you into wood chip. Oh, crazy dude! Hey, homie! Yeah, 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 get him! This. You're lucky. We're not taking your pot, too. There's a bunch of more crews coming now. Oh, By the way, this is like all part of the place. Oh, it looks like you found me. You should have stayed in town. Yo. Nope, wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong thing. I only got so many bullets! One eternity later. <laughs> nigga, so I guess, I guess what we learned is, nigga don't think it ain't no fun if you had fucking with the homies, nigga. You feel me, my nigga? <laughs> yeah, I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, uh, you know your nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something, you know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here to say. Oh, shit, nigga, that's nothing. Shit, nigga, I know you done went all the Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying? Leaving the street niggas in the back, but... Damn, man, uh, way to keep a nigga down, my nigga. I mean, thank you. I guess it's payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting them cars and shit, you know what I'm talking about? Give a nigga just enough money to get him a little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the pole house, huh? Man, don't be like that, dawg. Because number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. No matter how many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours to try to get us killed, I saved you, dawg. Hoes to my nigga. I thought we was homies for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The best thing you can hope for is a big turn off of your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. What? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving your nigga in the backfield. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you would get some work. But instead, you want to be this game-banging, mad-dogging asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Card. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nigga, who you think I am, nigga? Well, fuck you, Lamar. No, nah, fuck you, F, nigga. I thought we was homies, nigga. But that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. You know what, dawg? If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dog. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in a turf, nigga, if you remember what that is. Oh! What's up, player? No, oh, no. Man, I don't know y'all. We done, Hey, man. we ain't done yet, homie. Not yet. Nearly. Man, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill the president? 
fuck his wife or some <laughs> or invade some fucking country. No, no, something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey, when the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out to pasture. Oh, me? Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Man, mm. Trevor saved you. He saved both y'all asses. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. Oh. Man, get Michael to do it. Bro. Me and Trevor cool, dog. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. Uh. Fuck. Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Flossing ass, nigga. Um. That's it for part one um you know we're nearing the end of the story uh thank you guys for joining i'm gonna just get straight to recording part two and uh yeah i'm gonna get, just get straight to recording part two and then let y'all put it i mean put it up so uh yeah <laughs> see y'all in part two <laughs> that's all folks <laughs> It's musicality on the track. Monogatari, Kokoyori, Sunen Sakanobu.